damn speed! I feel faster than Sonic! Zoom! Bruh, you literally just copy pasted. That thousand dollars is mine! This is the Build Hack Battle where we show you building tricks so cranked your friends won't believe they're real. You in the comments decide who wins. Hey yo, are y'all sick of your friends stealing all your loot? Because I know I am fed up to the max with Ethan taking my diamonds whenever he fancies. He's just not scared of me, guys. He just doesn't fear me at all. So we're gonna change that, guys, all right? We're going to inspire some intimidation with this Iron Throne from Game of Thrones. Super easy to build, but it's made out of literal tritons. I'm challenging him to a 1v1 on the air hockey table because I'll have you know, I'm an air hockey connoisseur. All right, we're gonna chuck down our anvil and we're gonna grab ourselves a trident and enchant this with literally any enchantment. We're gonna use channeling one here. And now we just wanna throw an absolute ton of these around on the side of our throne. Basically, this is gonna make the entire thing look super spiky, super scary, and nobody is gonna mess with me, all right? Nobody is stealing my diamonds again. The only thing with this is, is it takes a little bit, all right, guys? For this one, what you're gonna need is you're gonna need an iron frame, and essentially, I'm gonna be using this idea, like that, so it looks sort of like uh, uh, the puck hitting thing, but we can use invisible item frames. All right, and bada bing, bada boom, that is the command. If you wanna type that in, that well, I'm stupid. There we go. Okay, perfect. And then we chuck our invisible item frame down, and bop. There we go. How good does that look? Even though this ain't some cozy couch by the fireplace, that ain't no excuse for it not to be comfortable. So we're gonna chuck down some red carpet and drop a minecart down. Here I'm going to be using uh, a different kind of technique for the lights. It's gonna be actually utilizing banners with iron frames, which does sound like a weird mixture because, well, it is. You gotta get just under them like that and place them like that. There we go. Chuck these in. So now it's like overhead lights. I think that's actually really cool. I just think it's a unique thing to add, and I think it is going to destroy Jordan. Jordan, I challenge you to air hockey for a singular band. Uh, this table seems to be lacking the uh air. Oh, uh. bro! <laughs> just go away. Okay, functionality is hard these days. Bow down to me, bro. Your chair needs a haircut. Luckily, I'm above. I've been Excuse doing me. this. Hey, what are you doing? Just cut a bit over here. Take a bit off the top. Bro, those and are there those were expensive trinkets. Get out of here. Stop selling my chair, man. Look, I fixed his hair, bro. I'm a barber. It has been brought to my attention that some people in the comments seem to think that these build battles are getting a little too intense. A little toxic, some even say. So you know what? I'm here to bring the chill back. Even though, you know, there's a thousand dollars on the line. So what? You know what? We're heading to the beaches of Hawaii. So first off, I'm making some bongos because we've got to have a soundtrack to our new chill lives here. So we're using this white banner with these red lines through the center alongside these barrels. And you get these awesome bongos. I absolutely love the way they look. I'm going to make Sanic because Sanic is is cool. We're going to be using an armor stand generator. Give ourselves a man looking like this. I'm gonna place some armor on here. He looks like Sonic. Well, not yet. I'm gonna use a lot of other armor stands to make him pretty. We have blue wool. Chuck that on his head. It's Sonic. I'm gonna match him every time. We are going to now make this guy have like little quills out of his back and we're probably gonna give him gloves and he's gonna need a snap. Oh boy, this one's gonna be tough. We got the bogo music playing. We need those hula dancers there. So first we need the skirts and we can use the azalea bushes or the flowering azalea, depending on which one you like. Then we're gonna grab our dispenser here, guys. Chuck in an armor stand. And you wanna go ahead and chuck one of these behind each of your azalea. We're going to activate those and that's gonna actually push the armor stands inside the azalea. It's the only block that you can actually do this for. And I think it looks absolutely awesome. And already these are beginning to look like hula dancers. We've gone from this dude to, well, these dudes. It is a lot Long journey, but he has eyes and a snout at least and some cool gloves. We're gonna chuck some uh, oak fences here above each of our playheads and you wanna have a downwards facing piston. And we're gonna activate those pistons like so. Now, since there aren't armor stand hands on Java Edition, we're able to add those in using the gates. And it looks like they're actually throwing their hands up doing the hula. I love it. Now, if you're on bedrock condition, you can literally just change their pose. But you can't do that in this version, all right, guys? We have Sonic. How pog is he? I love this man. He's got the quills using, like, legs from the armor stands. Very, very ingenious. Now, you can leave them like this. Or you can have them holding up some party decorations. And in my case, I want them to be holding up some flowers. So we're going to place down our flower pots there. We'll grab some flowers in a second. And I also reckon we can add some lights on the side here. Some tiki towers. And these are perfect with iron doors and a little bit of candles on each side. Then we're going to go ahead and light those. The beginning of the loop-de-loop. -loop. Uh, this is very tight. It's okay. It's Minecraft. It's a Minecraft loop-de-loop. -loop. It's just going to be 90 degree angles. We don't talk about it. Um, but we're going to have to do this pattern because uh, the Green Hill Zone always has this pattern. I'm not a chess player, but I'm here making a chess board. Don't judge me. Presenting EY Stream on the Bongos and his trio of hula dancers. Woo! Wait, Ethan, Ethan, where did, Ethan, oh, where did yeah, you go? Look at my moves. Boom, 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 boom. Look at uh, my moves. Uh, yeah. Ethan, 
Yeah. Who skirt did you steal? If Esther calls John, do not pick up that phone. Running around at the speed of sound. Get up the... Bro, Run you're not Sonic. And neither is this imposter. What is this cursed Netflix movie design, bro? What do you mean, bro? You're cancelled. You've been hedgehoggers. We built a throne. We've been to the beach. So why not go in between and create a mutant baby? <laughs> I'm building a beach throne. Well, not exactly. I'm going to be building a sand castle for my sand empire. This is a great way to decorate any, like, desert biomes you have. I think it's fantastic. All right, so we're going to place some fences there. I'm thinking we'll create the middle with chiseled blocks. Then we'll go upside down. Oh, yeah, this is going to look brilliant. I'm going to build a pirate ship because I like money and pirates like money. Yar! The beauty of this design, actually, is that you can actually sit in it. I'm going to be placing this boat right here. Look at that! And you can sit in the pirate ship. How cool is that? I'm, I'm, I'm facing the wrong way. Bruh! You know what? I want to add some flags onto these, all right? If we have these little sticks, now what could we use as a flag? I mean, we could use some red stained glass. That could work. We could do something like that. Or we could even use, like, a red banner. That could work as well. Uh, I don't know. Oh, you know what we could do? We could have an armor stand holding a red banner because then it should come out right this side. Wait, if we just copy an armor stand there. Oh, that's genius. Oh, I'm literally the biggest brain. Oh, that looks so good, guys. You need to grab yourself some black banners. You just want to chuck them on there. Of course, they are the sails. They're showing the way the wind blows. Uh, but in Minecraft, they sort of just... They sort of just do that. They just go back and forward, which is not very accurate, but that is okay. I'm gonna put ourselves a composter because that's like the the little the little lookout deck thing you stand. I'm gonna need a loom now because what we're gonna do is we're going to be making the skull and crossbones, as all good pirate ships have, like that, like that, and then we chuck one of them up there. And now, of course, guys, we're gonna use my favorite feature ever added to Minecraft. All right, that's a little bit of exaggeration, but this was my favorite part of the aquatic update waterlogged blocks. So we're going to place a bunch of sandstone stairs and basically create mini moats around our sandcastles because who doesn't love a good moat, all right? And then we're just going to fill all of this in with water and we should be done. Yar, har, har, give me your booty. And the thousand dollars, please. Uh, yeah, I don't think your ships actually move, so I'm taking that thousand dollars with me. Bye. No, please! <laughs> move, ship, move! Yeah, come on! Na, 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 I'm the king of the castle and you're the dirty rascal. Nah, bro, I'm the dirty pyromaniac. Let's do this thing! Your castle be my TNT! Bro, come on, it was literally sand. You just... You, 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 that was so unnecessary. Don't you all wish you were just, you know, incredibly rich? Yeah, me too, but unfortunately, it ain't true. But it can be whatever you like in Minecraft, including owning your very own personal racing motorbike simulator inside your house. Like, listen to that. That sounds awesome, guys. I absolutely would. If I had this in real life, you would. there would be no videos. I'd be playing this all day. <laughs> we all know John's a filthy crook, so I'm going to be putting him in his place. In prison, he goes. Everyone, this is joke. Jordan is not a filthy crook. You can make yourself, like, a really cool prisoner design if you get, like, a chain coming up this. And then we're just going to push this. And look at that. How cool is that? It's like the, the chain ball thing, the really heavy. Anyway, he can't escape. This guy is locked down. So now we're going to be building him a prison cell. I'm thinking we're going to use iron trapdoor here for the seat. And then off this, if you crouch, we can place a grindstone on the back and front. Those are the wheels looking absolutely slick. Now, I like to use a slab here and place the levers on the sides. Now, unfortunately, you can't place them straight on. You have to use a little bit of a trick by placing blocks on the side here and placing your levers on those blocks. You may be thinking, what is this? This makes no sense at all, all right? Hey, bear with me, guys. You're going to open up chat, type slash give, A with the squiggle around it, the at symbol, P, D, bug, stick. This thing can do a bunch of magical wizardry things. Basically, you point it here, and we're going to click on this, and we can move it all to different locations we want, and essentially, we need it facing towards our cut copper slab here. Now, of course, guys, if you don't want to use commands, you can just turn this into a full block, and you can place them straight on. I just like using a slab for looks. Perfect, Amondo. And now, the real prison. You thought this was done? Oh, no. We're going to be doing a real prison now. So we're going to probably start here like that. Perfect, Mondo. Now we're going to grab this, grab this. Oh, such move. Uh, we'll go maybe 12 up. I'm stupid. We can now copy this over to that side. We can fill in the walls and Jordan will never escape. Now you can actually sit in your motorcycle. But uh, I don't want to really drive into the abyss of the void. So we're going to grab ourselves a loom here, guys. Check that down. And we're going to make a virtual world. Place these two on the sides facing inwards. That in the middle. Oh, no. We want to hang that on the back wall like so. And this is going to be like the little slot. You know how uh, for arcade machines, guys, you have to like put in some money to get it to run. We're going to place the trapdoor there. Put that gray banner in front. And boom, you're done. 
Fun Racing Simulator. Welcome to my build. Don't mind the very evil, dark, foreboding exterior. Uh-huh. Just follow sure. me, follow me. It's very Pog Champ, Pog Champ in here. I'm not liking the vibes of this place. If you, they don't if you will just uh, go in there and stop speaking, uh, that is now uh, your. Look at him. How cool is that build? It's so great. Uh, it's well, great. he's your best friend for life. See Excuse you, me, Jordan. wait. What See you around, buddy. Prison nice meeting wait, you. Nice knowing you. Bro, you put me in adventure mode? What the flip? 